Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we are going to drive on Hagley Park Road and Hagley Park Road takes us from the halfway tree area down to Spanish Town Road. And we are on Hagley Park Road now, the road on the left that is Maxfield Avenue. Now Hagley Park Road is one of the busiest roads in Jamaica and it was recently renovated. I must say the government did an excellent job in fixing this road because there are a lot of business places on Hagley Park Road. It's a very busy road, very commercial, a lot of commercial buildings. But Halfway Tree is the busiest place in Jamaica. That's where you have the major transportation hub. And Hagley Park Road takes us from Halfway Tree to Spanish Town Road. Now, the busiest intersection in Jamaica is actually the intersection of Hagley Park Road and Spanish Town Road. That's the busiest intersection in Jamaica. So naturally, a road that takes you from the busiest place in Jamaica, which is Halfway Tree, to the busiest intersection in Jamaica should be a very nice road and it should be fixed up and very modern looking because it's, the road is used so much. So the government identifying the need to fix the road went ahead and did it. And as you can see, it's a very nice road. A dual, dual carriageway separated by the concrete barricade, street lights, nicely paved, has the white markings, the white lines. Very, very nicely done. And you might be thinking, but doesn't every road have white lines on it and street lights and those things and unfortunately not not all and just the point of when we say government we don't necessarily mean the government that's in power it's whichever government built this road and as you know one government might start it and another one finish it so we're not a political channel we just say the government did an excellent job i honestly don't even remember which government started this project or which one finished it but it was very nicely done. And this is how every main road should look in Jamaica. And the government, or I should say the governments of the past, have been really doing a good job in fixing these roads. They can't be fixed all at once, we know that. But Marcus Garvey Drive was fixed, Hudson Spring Road was fixed, Barbican Road was fixed, the highways are being extended. So I guess one step at a time. Okay, on the left is the domes. It's a very popular plaza, um, commercial district in Jamaica. It has like warehouses, but the warehouses have like a showroom at the front. On the right is a betting, gaming and lotteries office. And they take care of all the gambling in Jamaica, so to speak. They call it gaming, not gambling out here, but they're in charge of it. Now coming to the intersection with Walton Park Road. All right, so we mentioned earlier that the busiest intersection in Jamaica is the one between the intersection of Hagley Park Road, which we're on with Spanish Town Road. Now, the government also did an excellent job in building a double overpass at this intersection. It's the only double overpass in Jamaica, and I must say it has really helped with the flow of traffic. So we're going to look at that now. That's the overpass straight ahead. We are, we are on Hagley Park Road, which is the higher of the two overpasses. So the, high, the higher one is Hagley Park Road. The one below it is Spanish Town Road. And then you still have the original intersection at, on the ground level. So a lot of progress is going on in Jamaica, especially on the roads. Now you might ask, why is this intersection so busy? 
Well, one, Hagley Park Road takes you from halfway three, but also, if you're heading into Jamaica, into Kingston, from Portmore and Spanish Town, which are the two, those areas have the largest population outside of the city of Kingston, you would take Spanish Town Road into Kingston, the city of Kingston. So this is where you intersect. If you're coming from Portmore, over the Portmore Expressway, you would come on to this road. You'd come to this intersection, I should say. So here we are going over the higher one. And if you're coming in from Mandela Highway, you would also go on to Spanish Town Road and intersect here. Also, the Kingston Wharf, which is or the container terminal of Jamaica, that's it straight ahead. That's the wharf in Kingston. That's the largest wharf in Jamaica. And guess what? You have to go through this intersection to get there. So that's another reason why it's so busy. Also, you have a lot of communities of Spanish Town Road, and that also makes this intersection very busy. All right, so if we were to turn left here now, we would go on to Marcus Garvey Drive, and that will take us into downtown Kingston and also to the wharf but we're going to go here and make a u-turn now at this stoplight if we turned right we would go on to the portmore expressway and that would take us into the municipality of portmore but we're going to make a u-turn and go back over the, the overpass So at this intersection now, or at this light, those cars on the left, they are coming off the Portmore Expressway. So they are actually coming from Portmore into the city of Kingston. And that's a very nice view of the overpass. It's a rainy day today in Jamaica, so that's why the video isn't as bright as usual. But it rains at this hour, at this time of day. For, it has been raining for the last two weeks so there isn't really much we can do to avoid it hopefully the weather clears up soon all right guys thanks for taking the tour with us remember to like share and subscribe have a good day